good morning. What's good? Look where I'm at, man. Right back in the saddle. About to get my feet wet right quick. You know, get the kinks out. You know, been away for a while. Uh, nice little home time. Uh, you guys don't know who I am. My name is Lockout Man. At this good early in the morning, as you can tell. You know, got outside, pre trip my truck. Now they got me on the low right quick handy from Ohio down to Indianapolis, man. What's going on guys? Lockout man here, hollering at you on another day tripping video. Hey, but check it out, man. I'm at home. I'm in Cleveland, y'all. Check it out. Terminal tower in the background. That You know what, that's a nice picture right there. I'm about to get a picture. All right, anyway, I'm on my home time. You know, my home time make, don't come up until next week. You know, on the 14th. But today, I was able to get a load that actually brought me to Cleveland and I will actually do my two-day weekend, my two-day holiday here at home. Check it out, y'all. This is Cleveland. This is where I'm at. This is my hometown. Check it out. Cleveland baby only in Cleveland right there right there baby that's that's it right there
What's going on, drivers? So right now, I'm on my home time right now, so I'm chilling at the barber shop right now. So I'm about to go in here and get my hair cut. As you can see, I'm looking a little scruffy. You know, getting about to get my hair cut right quick to get back right. I'll come back at you. Won't be looking like this. This is the, this the before pick. This is the before pick. About to come back at you with an after pick in a minute. My man, yeah. I haven't seen you in a hot minute, B. What's good, Butch? This is my barber right here. So what's going on, man? And he ain't even, he ain't even finished yet, y'all. He ain't even finished yet. Wait till he hit the lineup. But well, there you have it, y'all. Looking all fresh and clean in this chair right here. Look at that boy. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Mike Love. I appreciate it. You know, guys, check him out. He's here at Fadeaway Barbershop right here on 185th. I was about to say, 185th and St. Clair. I don't say that. I don't know. <laughs> He's on 185th Street. Let me check my man out. <laughs> Ooh, like I said, y'all, look how look how fresh and clean I look. I look fresh and clean, looking like a whole new man right here, dude. I'm not even I'm not even gonna wear my hat. That's how smooth I'm looking. But right here, y'all, fadeaway barbershop, right here on uh on 185th Street. On 185th Street. Excellent barber, y'all, y'all, y'all want y'all, y'all not getting y'all not getting clean right. This man right here is to come to. All right, y'all, on my day tripping here at home in Cleveland, Ohio, my hometown, y'all. Uh, about to head over to uh over to the school where I used to uh where I used to go to school at, where I got my CDLs from. Go down there, see what they looking like. All right, I. I just can't help but look at myself, man. He, he cleaned me up good. Here we are at uh, Tri-C Truck Driving Academy here in Euclid, Ohio. This is where I got my uh, CDL training from, y'all. Um, when I went here, I, I did the uh, nights because uh, I, I, I still had a job during the day. Yeah, like two months, September. October, November, yeah. Or it was, it was probably a little bit longer than that. Because I didn't get my license until like the first week of December, I think. But in any case, this is a this, this is a good truck driving school for you guys want to come to a uh, want to come to learn how to drive a truck. I highly suggest Tri C Truck Driving Academy. All the other guys here did an awesome job. 
awesome job so let's go out here on to the uh, skills pad and see what these characters out here doing This is uh this is my man right here. Let let him let him do his thing right quick. This is my man Dale right here. Uh, What's going on, what's baby? Going on, man? How you feel, man? How you doing, man? I've been doing all right. I've been doing all right. The new students, Dale, man. They they getting it together. Okay, okay. Yeah, I see you got a. I see you got a couple of new students out here. You know, out here trying to do their thing here at the Tri C Truck Driving Academy. So this, that's my man Dale right there doing the damn thing. You know, definitely teaching the students how to get out and look. Right now, she's in the midst of doing her crossover right now. She got how many kids she got doing the day right now? Oh, uh, day class about 14. 14? Yeah. So you got so you say you got like two in a uh two on the road right now. It look like you got about two full, about six. Yeah, about right eight now. on the road. Eight on the road and the rest of them here doing the skills. Oh yeah. How's uh how how's the alley doc coming along for these people, man? They uh, they catching it? Check it out. Or they bro. had or they had problems like I did when I first started. Oh no, they all started off with problems. They work through it. instructors up here at Tri-C Truck Driving Academy. So if you guys want to get your CDLs, I highly suggest you come up here and talk yeah, to this come man. Come on right up. Here. Come on. This man right here. Right here. Alright, so I'm about to go ahead and head in right quick, see if anybody on the inside holler at them right quick. And then, um, I guess, uh, I don't know. About to go and get something to eat, I guess. Maybe a salad. Right there. Maybe a burger. What you got? Hey. I don't know. All right, about to holler at you in a minute. Yeah, guys, that's my time up at uh up at Tri C Truck Driving Academy. You know what I'm saying? If you guys is uh interested in uh getting your CDLs, you know this is one of the uh one of the uh truck driving schools uh here in the city of Cleveland that you can uh that you can go to and rock out at and get your CDLs. Um, as I said before, I said this once and I say this again. Once you get your CDLs, fellas, ladies, drivers, 
guard your shit. You feel me? Guard your shit. All right? You don't want to lose your CDLs for nothing, y'all. It is hard. It is hard to get them. And once you get them, you need to you need to guard it. And once you have them, like I said, keep it keep keep it guarded, man. Keep it guarded. It's your gold card. It's your livelihood right now. Your CDLs is your livelihood right now. Because without them, that nice little paycheck that you like getting every week, you won't be getting that from anywhere else. So guard your shit. Try C Truck Driving Academy, y'all. Uh, the link is in the description. The link is in the description. So if you guys want to get with them, definitely look, you know, look in, look into it, and uh, holler at them, and uh, tell Dale that I sent you. All right, guys, y'all still day tripping with me here on my hometown. I mean, on my home time in uh, in the city of Cleveland. So uh, I don't know what the next stop gonna be, but it's gonna be somewhere. to the gun range with my Glock 9 right here. It's been a while since I fired it. Um, I want to see if I still got it. At least I should. We're right here on uh, Vine Street right quick. And uh, about to go in here and uh, fire off some stress. So hang out with me and see what's up.
sack of bullets. Oh, you already got the sack. Oh, you already got the sack. So, like I said, if you want to get some stress relief going on and you're in uh, in the Cleveland, Ohio area, come on down to uh, East Lake, uh, Ohio, and come to Sherwood. It's a nice, it's a nice target range, you know. Like I said, my favorite is um, is Point Blank, but here you you can pretty much just pay for just pay fifteen dollars for unlimited for unlimited time and you're good to go all right also check out that ar-15 that's mean too man yesterday had some had some good times good times yesterday today i'm about to head over to my favorite breakfast spot and um and get my uh breakfast on here at big al's right here on launch mirror so if you guys really want a good breakfast good portions big al's fucking awesome <music> Fellas, drivers, I'm telling y'all, they breakfast are are on point. So if you ever in Cleveland and y'all want something to eat, a good breakfast for in the morning, Big Al's right here on Launchmere. Come check them out.
casino. Up. Never left out of here up, man. I always play with like 60 bucks or something like that. And then come back, come back, you know, and I leave out of here, you know, having a good time or whatever, whatever. But dude, I never hit like that, man. Not in, not in this place. Are you kidding me? Let me tell you guys something. It was up and down, up and down, up and down all day, all day. We got down to three-handed. It was three of us left at the table, three-handed, all right? Now, this never, never, never happened to me in my, in, in my poker career, okay? Let me tell you what happened. Every hand, bingo, bingo, bingo. The one dude was raising with the eight because I was playing for eight limit. All right, but he kept raising, you know, pre-flop eight dollars. So I called him. I was getting fucking bingo ass cards, man. All the cards I was getting was bingo. Okay, this is Jack Cleveland Casino where some people never win. But look, man, I'm good. I had a good night. I had a good poker night. About to get uh, about to get back at it on Monday, so I'm at home with my family one more night. Hey, <laughs> I just got photo bombed right there. All right, so I'm back at it. About to make it home at night, man. Have a good night. I'm up. first floor that I just showed you, the second floor which we're on right now, and the third floor which of course is the poker room. I don't know how many poker tables they got, but they got a lot of poker tables. And they run a lot of tournaments. Well, that's it here at Jack's Cleveland Casino, here in my hometown. Um, I'm glad you guys came along with me. Thanks for hanging out with me. And if you guys have any questions or anything like that, leave it in the comments below. Until then, I will get back at y'all with another video. Peace.